Hey there, so today we are diving into something really exciting, 10 After Effects hack that every motion designer needs to know to up their game. And no, we are not talking about hacking as in a free After Effects, don't get any ideas. These are genius tricks that will save you time, frustration and a whole lot of mouse clicks. Let's go. And for the first hack, did you know we can move shapes while creating them? Ever created a shape and thought to yourself, oops, I wanted it over there, not here. So how can we fix it? To create a shape, select the shape tool, but make sure no layer is selected because otherwise we'll be creating a mask. So click and drag in the composition panel to create a shape and then press and hold the spacebar to move it around without letting go of your mouse. Voila, easy as that. And by the way, it also works for masks. Hack number two, the properties panel, your new best friend. Have you noticed the shiny new properties panel in After Effects? This little gem gives you an instant access to all the essential properties like position, rotation and scale without opening the layer properties. Want to animate something? Just hit the stopwatch directly in the panel. It also works for shapes, changes fill color, the stroke width and even caps for your strokes. Oh, and if you have the updated After Effects, it now works for cameras and light layers. Time saver! In hack number 3 I show you how you can easily reset properties. Sure you can right click and hit reset but there is an even faster way for the key properties like the position, scale and rotation. Each of these has a corresponding tool in the top toolbar. Double click the tool icon and boom it resets the property instantly. No menus, no hassle. On to hack number four, centering the anchor point. Is your anchor point all over the place? Don't worry it happens to the best of us. To center it go to layer transform and then center anchor point in the layer content. Even better, center Set a shortcut for it and save time. Or for more control, grab the anchor point tool in the toolbar and hold control to snap it to the center, corners or edges. A center anchor point makes your animation so much easier, trust me. Hack number 5, two viewers are better than one. This hack is golden if you are working on a nested comp. Sometimes you are tweaking something in the pre-comp and you want to see the results in the main comp simultaneously. Here's what you can do. Lock the viewer in your main comp, click on that lock symbol in the composition panel, then go to view, new viewer in the top menu. Now you've got two composition panels, one for the pre-comp and one for the main comp. It's Comception. Now for a bonus hack, using the plugin Storyblocks. I literally can't live without it. You can download unlimited stock assets without leaving After Effects. All you need to do is click the download button and BOOM! Your clips will appear in the project panel. Storyblocks, thank you so much for sponsoring this video. Imagine you shoot a clip where you needed some post tracking, you fly all the way home just to realize your shot was out of focus and basically untrackable. Yeah, you should have used Storyblocks. Storyblocks' this curated stock library has everything you need to create high quality video in one place. With over a million 4K in HD footage, templates, music, sound effects, images and much more. You can download unlimited high quality assets for one predictable subscription cost. You can say goodbye to expensive pay per clip pricing. You will enhance your social media videos by accessing exclusive Storyblox label music tracks directly in TikTok, Instagram, Facebook and YouTube. At the meantime, Storyblox will fully protect you from copyright strikes, claims and all that stuff, so that you can focus on what matters most, creating. Besides that, you can save hours of your time with pre-made motion graphic templates for After Effects, Premiere Pro, Apple Motion and DaVinci Resolve. To get started with unlimited stock media downloads at one set price, head over to storyblocks.com slash After Effects Basics or click the link in the description below. After that huge hack story blocks, let's shift on to the hack number 6, shift link parenting. You probably know how to parent layers using the pick whip tool, that little spiral icon in your timeline. But here's the twist, hold shift while parenting. This snaps the child layer directly to the parent's position. No manual adjustments, no fiddling with coordinates, just link and done. Now you guys know I love an organized project and that's why I love hack number 7. Markers are your roadmap in complex project. You can create one by pressing the asterisk key on your numpad. But here's where it gets fun. Alt plus asterisk lets you add a comment to your marker. Complete with a color label. Use this to mark beats, important cues or reminders like don't forget to render. It keeps your timeline organized and your sanity intact. Believe it or not, but hack number 8 is also a new one for me. Copying effect with property links. Let's say you've got two layers and you want them to share the same effects and settings. Sure, you could copy and paste, but what if you want 
want them linked. Easy. Select your effects, go to edit, copy with property links or use the shortcut Control alt c Paste it onto the new layer and voila! Any changes you make to the master layer automatically update on the linked layer. Fancy. We are almost there guys. Hack 9. Getting smoother animations. Ever have an animation that feels a bit clunky? Let's fix that. For example, I have this ball shape animation that moves to one side and then back. As a real animator, I will of course give an easing to my keyframes. The begin keyframes get an ease out, the end keyframe an ease in, and the middle keyframe an easy ease. But as you can see, the middle keyframe makes the ball stop a little and it isn't smooth at all. So the fix is to select all keyframes, right click and go to keyframe interpolation. Set temporal interpolation to continuous bezier. Then open the speed graph in the graph editor to smooth out the motion. No more awkward stops, just buttery smooth transitions. And here comes the last hack. Cropping your comp with surgical precision. We all have struggled to resize a comp to fit your assets. Stop guessing. In the composition panel, hit the region of interest button. Draw a box around the area you want, then go to composition and then crop comp to region of interest. Boom! Your comp now fits your assets like a spandex pants. And there you have it, 10 After Effects hacks that make you feel like Neo from the Matrix. If you want to learn even more hacks and tricks, click on the video right here on my left. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.